ones making the determination on when and how oh, fucking filming. Oh, oh, it's Mike from Homies Depot. The home of the seconds because I can't keep taking stuff back and getting facing these people because I'm going to start to become rebellious as usual. So anyway, I do a little Ohm's test on one of their timers that's doing the same thing that all the rest of them go batched it did. Uh, you'll um, see what I mean in a moment. Anyway, the way I do it is use the Ohm's test. Uh, take your meter, of course, put it on the Ohm's setting. And um, what you want to do is go where the pump wires to the pump, to the pump, and hook the wire, uh, load line, okay, load line. So the load's out, line's in, okay. So you put your two load to your ohms meter. And you're going to run your clock dial in as if it's in your automatic, not as if, but in your automatic setting. You want your, because what it's not doing is it's not turning off. It, it's indexing through all of its zones, the eight zones I have it set on. But what it's not doing is, and of course I got the skipper wheel. I have it set on every day of the week. Every, all these are out, so it's, I want it to go on each day of the week. Blah, 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 oi, oi, oi. What's happening is these here are not turning off. They're going through all the um, malarkey of each zone, shutting down between each zone, doing the day of week, blah, blah, blah. But what good is it if at the end of the cycle it doesn't shut off? So in other words, at 4 a.m., when this sapling supposed to go for 15 minutes and shut off, or three or whatever the hell I have it set for on this last journey, it's not shutting off. It's just running and running and running into eternity. Why won't it shut off? The nose itches now. Son of a bitch.